<laughs> You've both worked with some great directors. Uh, and I, and I wanna know what it's like working with Tim Burton from an actual directing standpoint. How's the actual directing different? Well, he's very, um, you feel very involved with the whole process as an actor. He's, yeah. he's always sharing his ideas with you. He always wants you to have a really clear understanding of his vision. And uh, as, 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 as well as that, he really wants you to have your input and your own input because obviously you're kind of, you're the character, so you, you kind of need to own it and you need to feel comfortable doing it. So it's, uh, there's a lot of collaboration involved. Yeah, I, I like, I enjoy working with him. I think he, we always compare him to a mad scientist. He, <laughs> he sort of mixes all these crazy things, these lotions and these potions, and no one really understands what he's doing, and he just mixes it and, and creates this wonderful movie. Um, and, and, you know, he's so creative and so visual, and he's got all this sort of movement and energy, and it's infectious. Like, everybody's sort of drawn to him because he's got such a, kind of a great personality and such enthusiasm and passion for his job. Can I point out that I'm sitting in a very comfortable chair and you we guys know are not? This. I know. We know this. There's an we empty one behind you there. So there I, is. I requested that we have a, a, a bean bag. Musical chairs? And, uh, that would have been yes. perfect. And, um, we should swap. And, and a nap. But <laughs> Maybe you after. You can take a nap. You just had a nap. Please not during the interview. <laughs> Your character at the start says something interesting talking about how like your teenage years are, are difficult. And you're about to exit your teenage years. You've just exited your teenage years. Yeah. Yeah. Finally. What, what, have they, what have they taught you? I would never go back. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, they've taught me to stop plucking my eyebrows. Don't squeeze your spots. Uh, no, I mean, that's a stupid. That is good advice, though. Well, yeah, don't squeeze your spots. Put toothpaste on them. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Does it matter what or flavor? perfume or like alcohol, it just dries them up. Wow. Yeah. Beauty uh -huh. tips. That explains it. <laughs> yeah, you've been popping them. I mean, you learn uh, a lot, don't you? You learn a lot. Don't take yourself too seriously. No. I think that's don't probably the biggest, the biggest thing I, uh, I learned. Yeah. And I still don't. I'd much rather be a kid than anything else. Yeah, yeah. me too. Enjoy Best years it. of your life. Yeah. I'm kind of sad. Yeah. 20. It's not that bad. <laughs> no, 20 is the big one. The big Wait, one. You can't even legally drink here yet. Well, here, in the legally. UK. Legally, I can't. No. <laughs> I see what you did there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, All right. <laughs> speaking of difficult, what's the most difficult scene that you guys had to film in this movie? Underwater stuff, gotta be, right? Yeah. Were you oh, saying you yeah, didn't yeah. know how to swim? Okay, yo, okay, I could swim. She just wasn't massively qualified. I, I could, I could, what's that, the doggy paddle? I could yeah. do that one. I just That's couldn't do good. the And, you know? Yeah. But now I can, I'm a pro. I'm gonna be in the Olympics. Really? No, of course not. See you in 2020. <laughs> Before we wrap this up, I just wanna point out that your shoes match my socks almost perfectly. The shoes which are not on my feet? Yes. Good stuff. 